In this video, we're going to look at setting sync points and aligning clips. Sync points are a really powerful feature in Pro Tools. Once you set the sync point in a clip, you unlock additional features when using the tab key and when using clip alignment key commands. To identify the sync point in a clip, use the selector tool to place the cursor at the desired location. In this case, I have a pad swell, and I want to use the peak of the swell for alignment purposes. So I'll drop the cursor near the peak, and then select Clip, Identify Sync Point, or press Command Comma on the Mac or Control Comma on Windows. And you'll see that the sync point appears near the bottom of the clip. Once I've assigned the sync point, I can use the grabber to reposition it. or hold Control on the Mac or Start on Windows to use the grabber to scrub the sync point. If I decide I want to delete the sync point, I can hold down Option on the Mac or Alt on Windows and click on the sync point. Or I can select the entire clip and choose Clip, Remove Sync Point, or once again press Command Comma on the Mac or Control Comma on Windows. Now that we've got a sync point assigned, let's move on to aligning clips. You have three options when aligning a clip to another clip in Pro Tools. To align a clip to the start of another clip, select the clip that you want to align to, and then hold either the Control key on Mac or the Start key on Windows and click on the clip that you want to have aligned. As you can see, the start of the clips are now perfectly aligned. <laughs> I can use the same modifier key to align the clip when dragging and dropping it from the clip list. Next we'll look at aligning the end of the clip. Once again I'll select the clip that I want to align to, but this time I'll hold Control Command on the Mac or Control Start on Windows and click on the clip that I want to have aligned. Note that the end of the swell clip is perfectly aligned to the beginning of the timpani clip. The last alignment option is to align the clip sync point. Once again, I'll select the clip that I want to align to, and then hold down Control Shift on the Mac or Start Shift on Windows and click on the clip that contains the sync point. And now you can see that the timpani clip is perfectly aligned to the sync point that we previously created in the swell clip. So those are the three methods for aligning clips in Pro Tools.